Hello there, um, ladies and gentlemen. Um, this is Shima again, shimahair.com. Um, I want to show you something very important. Starting with the beautiful and lovely and talented Janet Jackson. Now, as I show you this beautiful woman, I want you to take a really, really good look at them. And I want you to tell me what you think they all have in common. Take a really, really good look at them. I'm going to show you first three beautiful, super famous, you can say, you know, in the entertainment industry, black woman. Here's the lovely Tyra Banks. So you know she, you know, she's one heck of a model, has a very own talk show and everything. Um, she broke down barriers with her modeling career. Now she's breaking down barriers with her talk show. And she's, she's another icon, another beautiful black woman icon. But again, as I show you this beautiful black woman, take a really good look at them. I want you to tell me what you think they all have in common. You know who this gal is. Beyonce Knowles, also known as just Beyonce. Hmm, that's another one that's really up there. Remember, I want you with your thinking caps on. Take a good look at them. Yes, they're beautiful. Yes, they're gorgeous. But what do they all have in common? Mm hmm. I can hear your brains going a hundred miles per minute. Now, let's take a look at the following three white female celebrities. What do you think they all have in common? I'm going to show you three of them. This is Jessica Simpson. She has made her mark in the entertainment industry as a singer. She tried acting, didn't work out too well, but she you know. She she made it. Regardless, she, she's out there. Her name was out there for a minute. And she has some relevance. Her, she remember she had that show with uh, Nick Lachey. I think I'm pronouncing his name right. Okay. Here's another one. Christina Aguilera. Genie in the bottle herself. Hmm. What do these white female celebrities have in common? Hmm. Hope you're thinking. Here, her hair is black, but this is still Christina Aguilera. This is still the genie in the bottle. Mm -hmm. Giving you a chance to figure it out. Some of you probably already figured it out. Oh, look at this one. Amy Winehouse. Despite her personal trouble, she has made her mark in the entertainment industry as well. Winning about five Grammy Awards, I believe. Mm-hmm. But she also has something in common with the rest of the three, with the with all three female celebrities I'm just shown. Okay. Did you figure it out? Now this is me. For some reason, due to the fact that all of the female celebrity celebrities I've just shown you, when people see this hair. They're not thinking that it's my real hair. Mm -mm -mm. You know where I'm getting at? Mm -hmm. All of the female celebrities I just finished showing you, they all wear weaves. Not this girl, not Shima. This is her real hair. But the female celebrities that you all admire and want to emulate and do everything that they do and contribute to the myth that we can't have really long hair all wear weaves extensions wigs the point is it's all fake hair and I'm here to let you know it doesn't have to be that way it just doesn't have to be that way. 
our real hair can grow too. We don't have to cover up in weaves. It's not necessary. We just need to arm ourselves with the right information. That is all. SheMyHair.com is my site.